It's Amanda, and I am here with um, an ink video that I'm very, very excited about. We have the new, the newest 50 states from the Sailor 50 States line. We have Wisconsin and Indiana. Um, the colors are amazing, from what I can tell, and one of these is very near and dear to my heart. So, I'm gonna actually, before we get my swatch supplies ready, we'll talk about these. We have Wisconsin, which is this beautiful purple, and we have Indiana, which is this beautiful pink. And judging from the swatches I've seen online, I'm very excited about these. I'm very excited. Very, very excited. It fills in um, holes that I have been asking for. Well, not really asking for, but wishing um, were filled. And so we have Indiana. Sailor's Indiana ink is reminiscent of the soft pink petals of its intricate and much-loved state flower, the peony. Very pretty. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. And then we have Wisconsin, which is near and dear to my heart because it is the state. It's my home state, basically. Like, you hear me talk about Texas and stuff. Texas is a place that I lived before I moved out here. Um, but Wisconsin is my home state, and that is where home is. Sailor's Wisconsin ink mirrors the blue violet of a wood violet, Wisconsin's iconic state flower. So they went with state flowers this time. Very exciting. I I love this. I just, from the pictures that I've seen, I just love it so much. I'm very excited. Very excited. Very excited. Plus, I love, I love the color combination of the set that we've got. And from what I've seen online, this brings a bunch of light and bright to the collection, which is what I've been asking for and saying for a couple of months now. Like at least a couple of releases, I've been wanting bright and they've been giving me bright and I'm very, I'm very happy. I'm very happy about this. Um, yeah, so the Sailor 50 States inks, they released them in sets of two and um, they seem to be coming out every couple of months. So this one, these were released in April. So the next set will probably be released sometime in June if I had to guess. They're sticking to their schedule. Um, and so, yeah, so this is, I think the 22nd. I don't know. I've got the whole, I've got the whole shebang right here. So yeah, let's get, let's get to swatching. So we'll swatch these. We'll see where they fit in the set. If I can go through my cards and find things that I think are equivalent or close enough, or just want to see what they look like next to these, um, I will do that. And that will be your video. I was going to throw these in pens for 30 inks, 30 days, but we only have two days left and I have two inks that were viewer requests that I really want to honor. So I'm going to honor the viewer requests and then you'll see these probably in the currently inked video that I'm going to do sometime next month because we'll have a currently inked for May. I want to try to get it done kind of early in the month so I can spend some time with the pens for the month, but um, yeah. You'll probably, you'll probably see, be seeing these in uh, pens. So let's get our swatching supplies. As usual, I have my coloring cards. With these inks, I also picked up a couple more coloring cards because I'm getting low. And then I have a couple random paint brushes. And then we have my Moon Man Mini Glass Dip Pen, which is just that. And then, yeah, that's, that's all I have for swatching supplies. We're gonna keep it really simple. I start with Indiana, cause that's the one I grabbed. Super bright hot pink. It reminds me a lot of one of the like Sailor 131 or something maybe. I'm not sure. I could be wrong on the numbers. I get them mixed up, but yes, 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 yes. It's light or it's, it's really bright. Reminds me a little, well, I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna stop talking about what it reminds me of because I haven't seen it actually in person. But from what I saw online, I ordered these from Pen Chalet. Um, you can order them wherever Sailor inks are sold. Oh, this is so pretty. Um, order them from your favorite Sailor retailer. I order them from Pen Chalet because Pen Chalet has the best price, at least for me in the States. Well, I think this, the 50 States inks are only currently offered in the US. Um, Indiana. This is so freaking bright. I love it. I'm so in love right now. Like, I'm so happy. You, you have no idea how happy I am right now. It's 
super bright ink. Super, super bright. Super, super bright. Almost kind of highlightery. Super bright. <laughs> I love it. I love it. The 80s and 90s kid in me is super pleased. I'm super pumped. So that is Sailor Indiana. Off the top of my head, like I said, it reminds me a lot of um, Diamine Hope Pink. Um, also, I want to say one of the Noodlers, like, bright highlighter inks, but I don't remember the names of any of those. Um, so yeah. And definitely one of the Sailor's um, Ink Studio inks, but I, I want to say 131, but I don't know if that's the right number. Um, but yeah. Bright ass pink. Super, super, super pretty. Bright bubblegum pink. I, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Do I love it? Yes. I love it. I'm very excited. I'm very happy. I'm very pleased. Um... Yes, I will not stop talking about how pleased I am because I'm very excited. <laughs> Next up, we will have Wisconsin, which I'm very excited is purple because that is my home state. It's where I'm from. And purple is my favorite color. And I have somehow forgotten that the wood violet was the state flower. I didn't know that. I was like, oh, I learned something today. Thanks, Sailor. But I probably just forgot it. Yes, so my state inks are two purples. No, sorry. No, just kidding. Colorado's the purple one. California. So I have a teal, a purple, and a brown. Those are the those represents the states I've spent the most amount of time. Another bright, bright purple. I'm very excited. Very, very excited. Have I mentioned that I'm excited? Wait, is this the clean brush or the dirty brush? Okay, that's the one I use, so I want to use that one. Okay. Again, ordered these from Pen Chalet. Everybody else that I've seen them seems to sell these these inks for about twenty five dollars, and uh, Pen Chalet sells them for twenty. Sailor Fifty States. I'm gonna dip again. Maybe I should have gotten two of this one. Also reminds me of one of the Sailor Purples, the Sailor Ink Studio Purples. Maybe four fifty. I don't know if that's right. This is a really pretty purple. Okay, let's swatch it. Let's swatch it. <laughs> That's so pretty. It's so pretty. Looks like it's got some dual shady things going on. I see some blue. <coughs> I see some pink. The swatch almost looks like it's going to be kind of dual shady. Obviously, we'll have to see what it looks like when it dries. So that makes me think of, um, like, I think it's Troublemaker Foxglove a little bit. So, yeah. So we're going to let those dry. I'm going to see if I can find some inks to compare to it. But, um, yeah, my overall first impression thoughts are hell yes. Hell yes. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. This is my, this is, I'm not even joking. This is my favorite pair. These right here are my favorite pair. I know I've loved Georgia. I know that I've loved California. And I know that I've loved Texas a whole bunch. I've gotten like three bottles of tech. No, I've only gotten, have I gotten three bottles of Texas? I've fully used a bottle of Texas, but I don't think I've purchased a replacement for that. So I've got like two bottles of Texas. I have two bottles of Georgia. Um, yes, I love, this is my favorite set. I might need to go order. I might need to go order more. No, I don't. I know that I don't. Okay, I'm, I will be right back. Okay, everybody, we are back. We're gonna do some comparisons with some pinks and purples, and then we will go ahead and um, see where they fit in the full lineup. So here's our ink. I thought maybe Tutsuji because it's pretty bright out of a pen, but it's really, it's really, um, it's really not right. 
Then this is one of the ones that I thought, but even that's not really right. There's Noodler's Hellfire, which is another one of those highlightery inks. Again, not really right. Girls just want to have fun. A nice bright pink, but kind of soft and muted. Let me zoom in a little bit. Bunga Box Sweet Love Pink. Again, different pinks. My favorite pink of all time, Ackerman Gourmet Pens Pink. Diamine Cerise. This is a little more red, so not quite right. Rocco Alps Pink, which is, is it's pretty bright, but definitely not, not the same. Sailor Sakura Mori. I just did this for comparison. They're definitely different. This is way, way brighter. Diamine Carnation. I can't find my card for Diamine Hope Pink, but I think that's probably the closest actual um, thing. I have Diatramentous Marshmallow. This is much more muted. This reminds me of that watermelon ink. And then I found 131, which is not... I don't know what's going on with the edges of my card here, but 131 is definitely not at all like this. And then I picked 731, but 731 is more red. So, yeah. I still think Diamine Hope Pink might be the closest match. So, uh, it's also a lot more affordable and a lot more easily obtainable. Um, but I don't have, I don't know where the card is to compare it. So, hopefully I find it before we do... Uh, well, this isn't going to be in 30 inks, so... Um, it. If I find it, when I get it, we'll definitely compare. And then we have Wisconsin, which uh, we have here. I grabbed a bunch that, um, yeah, we have, uh, let me move these so they're in frame. Sailor Fuji Sugata. This is one of the um, sh Shikiori lines, I believe. Similar, this is a, a little darker. This has a little bit more blue in it, perhaps. Um, Noodler's African Violet, not really, not really the same. Um, Colorverse Delicious Sleep. Mm, I mean, it's not the same, but I like, I like how they look together. Van Diemen's Elizabeth's Violet Eyes. I mean, as we saw in Purple Week, there's a lot of variation in purples. We have Twisby Royal Purple. Birmingham Hydrangea, which is a little lighter. A little more dual shady. Graphon Faber Castell Violet Blue. This seems like it's a little darker, not a little more muted, but I mean, they're different purples, but I like them. Um, Pelican 4001 Violet. I knew this was going to be too dark, but it seemed like it had sort of the same brightness to it, but no. Um, Diatramentous Magenta Violet. Not at all even close, but. Um, a Sailor Ink Studio 150 is a little more uh, muted. I think some of this might have been light exposure because that's like an awful lot of blue around the border. But um, like the purples, well, the purples aren't even really similar. And then Sailor 450 is the one that I had in mind, and um, I don't, I don't think it's quite right. But another, another one that maybe close enough for you. I'm not sure. It's definitely a little darker. Not quite the same. Doesn't have the dual shadiness that this one seems to have a little bit, at least in the swatch. Um, but yeah. So overall, I'm, I, like I said, I'm super excited. I've been pumped about this since I saw it on Instagram. I'm in love. I freaking love. This is literally my favorite of the sets. My favorite of the pairs, but we need to see where it fits in the rest of the lineup and talk about that real fast. And I, I can tell you that I'm very happy. So we'll do Wisconsin up here. We'll do that. I'm going to zoom back out. I don't have enough space on my desk right now. I was making samples. I have samples to send to friends. So I've been making samples and taking my sweet ass time doing that. But... Okay. So then we have... South Dakota, and Arizona, and New Jersey, and Louisiana, and Washington, and Michigan, and Idaho, 
in Oregon. I wonder if anybody from Sailor has ever seen my videos. And when I say that I have like, oh, I wish we had this. I wish we had that. If they're just like, Mwahaha. actually, they probably haven't. They've probably never seen my videos, but Virginia and Oklahoma, Illinois, Georgia. I keep meaning to go look and see when these released as sets, but I haven't yet. Alaska and Florida, California, Pennsylvania, Colorado, New York, Vermont, Delaware, Maryland, Texas. Here we go. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. So we're at 24. So we're basically halfway. The next set will put us just past the halfway mark. So that's exciting. But yeah, here are um, our 24 states so far. The addition of these two just makes me so happy. It makes me so happy. I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased. Because now we have almost a bright ass rainbow. Which is really all I've wanted in the world. Uh, maybe I'll take that too. If we use the red as, or the pink as our red. Yeah. Roy. I don't really have a green, so we'll put that in there. And we also have this orange too. This, this can fit here. Maybe this is like the red because it's kind of reddish orange. I don't know. No, no. Maybe we do this. Maybe. No, I still think we do this. Roy, we'll pretend that's green. Blue. We'll pretend that's indigo and violet. Bright ass rainbow. Bright ass rainbow. I love it. I love it. I'm so happy. <laughs> I love, I love it. I love it. I, yes, I, this is the happiest I've ever been with Sailor, I think. Sailor, you knocked this out of the park. I'm so happy. Um, yeah. Well, let me know what you think in the comments below. How do you feel about these two inks? If you live in either Wisconsin or Indiana, are you happy with the colors they chose for your state? Um, yeah. I'm pleased with the colors overall. Like, I get the peony, I get violet, I get... Excuse me. I get what they're going for here. I'm very excited. This is a color that I was thinking could maybe be used for Hawaii. Um, also, but also I think like Alaska could be used for Hawaii or like Florida could have been or New Jersey could have been. So I'm excited to see what they come up with Hawaii because I've got nothing. I've got nothing. But they've used all the colors in all the other states. But yes, I am so excited i'm so excited in case you could not tell let me be very clear i love these i love these this is the most excited i've been about ink and i i don't know how long i yes sailor thank you thank you for a bright pink thank you for a bright purple thank you for brightening up this set i yes i can't thank you enough i'm so i'm so happy okay anyway I am going to go now because I've had enough of my own shenanigans. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that this was useful and helpful. If you didn't, um, if you don't think, I know these are hard to get outside of the U.S. So if you are somebody that um, can't get them or doesn't want to pay the overseas shipping, totally 100% understandable. Um, if any of those comparisons were useful, if you have another idea, let me know in the comments. We'll see what we can do. Um... Because you, you, you guys in the comments usually think of something that I haven't. So I really appreciate when you leave, like, suggestions. Um, so, yeah. Let me know what you think. Um, yeah. That's all I've got. That's all I've got. I will see you tomorrow with another 30 Inks 30 Days video. Probably, maybe. We're at the end, so I don't know. Um, I'm going to get this up on the 28th. We've got two more days left of 30 Inks. So if you watch this when it goes out. I will see you tomorrow with another 30 inks. <laughs> and if not, I will see you again very soon with another video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.